Taylor Swift might be the biggest name in music right now, but she's still not the richest. Did you know she recently joined the Billionaire Club? So Forbes recently dropped their list of the wealthiest celebs in 2024. Taylor Swift landed on it with a 1.1 billion net worth. But guess who else is on it? Jay-Z and Rihanna have pretty fat wallets, with 2.5 billion for Jay-Z and 1.4 billion for Rihanna. Taylor Swift isn't just rolling in dough from endorsements or side gigs. Her fortune is largely thanks to her savvy business moves in the realm of her music career. Her Eras Tour not only paid her well, but everyone on her team. Forbes revealed that she pocketed a jaw-dropping $190 million from this tour alone, after taxes. Now let's talk strategy. While Jay-Z and Rihanna have diversified their portfolios with business ventures like fashion and the liquor brands, Taylor Swift's focused mainly on her music. Sure, she's got a knack for writing relatable breakup anthems, but it's her tour earnings and streaming numbers that truly sealed the deal. But let's break down where else Rihanna and Jay-Z are getting their money. Rihanna's been raking in millions from her tours and her stakes in Savage X Fenty and Fenty Beauty. Meanwhile, Jay-Z's been playing the business game, selling off stakes in his brands like hotcakes. Bacardi splashed out 750 mil for his Cognac label. And LVMH forked over 300 million for his champagne brand. Talk about making it rain. But it's not all about the dough for these megastars. Swift's all about empowerment. She once said women should be proud to make money. And Rihanna? Well, she's not too keen on being put on a pedestal. In her own words, she'd rather keep her feet on the ground and stay true to herself. Now, let's dissect Taylor Swift's moolah-making machine. Her secret recipe includes a dash of real estate investments, a hefty slice of music catalog royalties, and a generous serving of touring revenue. And with her upcoming album, The Tortured Poets Department, dropping soon, you can bet her net worth's gonna see a spike. 